for joining us. I'm Terry Hood. And I'm Scott Thompson. First on 6 tonight, a small green country town almost shuts down for the day because of a water main break. The break happened this morning up in Dewey, leaving thousands there without water and forcing the school district to send students back home. Lacey Lowry has more from Washington County. These men are jackhammering through the thick concrete floor of the meter house to get to the main water line supplying the city of Dewey. Well, we wasn't expecting it. It's something that was underground you never see until it happens, and then you have to take care of it. When the line broke, the entire city lost water, including the schools. The break forced Dewey Public Schools to close Thursday morning because there was no drinking water and no way to use the restrooms. I've done this for a very long time and only dismissed early, maybe in 30 plus years, only three or four times. Thanks to a very coordinated effort, the schools were empty by 11 a.m. and all 1,200 students got home safely. Uh, you never know and, uh, exactly how these things will work out, but uh, we planned uh, to dismiss at 1030, which we did, and the buses ran on schedule. See you all later. A few kids did get on the wrong bus, so their mom, January Ryder, came to pick them up. My son and daughter rode the bus, and of course my daughter got on the wrong one, so that was a little bit of hysteria. Once the crew breaks through the concrete, they will replace an 8-inch line. These are the most urgent when you shut your whole town down. You've got to do something to get the water back on. The public works director says the break was caused by fatigue on a water line that's about 40 years old. So far, we've been fortunate not having any main breaks because of the weather. About 1,900 customers lost water, many of them businesses. No water, no service, as this driver found out at the car wash. The Washington County Rural Water District Number 1 also lost water. That's an, an additional 500 customers. Workers finally repaired the line around 4.30 this afternoon. And as of right now, every customer should have water service again. By the way, the city of Bartlesville did have some line breaks today from the weather, but those were not related to the Dewey break. Lacey Lowry, News on 6.